Hello children. How are you all? Hope fun. Yes. So good morning. Ready with your books and pencil? Good. So I will present lesson 9 pronouns. Number, gender, case. Okay. So in the previous session of English grammar, I have told you about pronouns and all its kind and their uses. Fine. So today I will tell you something different of pronouns that is pronouns, numbers, gender, case. So, we have already learned that pronouns are used in place of nouns. Yes. So, for example, Mother gave Devam a banana. She had cut it into eight pieces for him. So, in this sentence, in place of noun, word Mother, Devam and a banana I have used he ate her. Now we will see personal pronouns. So here personal pronouns is classified as first, second and third person. First person refers to the person person speaking. The words include I, me, we, us, are the first person of pronoun, first pronoun, okay, person pronoun. For example, we are going to play in the garden. In this sentence, we is the first person pronoun. Second person. Second person refers to the person, persons addressed or spoken to. For example, you can join uh, us in the party if you would like to. So, here in this sentence, you is the second person pronoun. Third person refers to the person, person spoken about. The words include he, him, his, she, her, hers, it, they, them, theirs. For example, they will also come to the cinema today. In this sentence, they is the third person. Pronoun. Now, let us see number. So, like nouns, pronouns may be singular or plural. Singular includes the words I, me, he, him, she, her, it, anyone, this, that, herself and so on. For example, this is her car. So, in this sentence, this is, this is telling about the car and her is telling about a single person. Plural. Now, plural number includes the words we, us, they, them, all, these, those, yourselves, theirs, ours, and so on. For example, we told them to meet us here. So, in this sentence, we is a pronoun. 
V is a pronoun word and V is used for more than one person and them is also used for more than one person and us is used for the word V. So this is the example of plural pronoun. Next we will study gender. Like nouns, pronouns may belong to the masculine, feminine, common or nuclear gen sorry neuter gender. Masculine includes the words he, him, his and so on. Okay. So, for example, my brother is short. He plays chess. So, pronoun he is used for the word my brother. Brother is a masculine gender. So, he is also a masculine gender. Feminine. Now, feminine gender includes the words she, her, hers and so on. For example, Meena is in my class. She is very good in studies. So, here she is used... Yeah, she is used in the place, the word, the noun word Meena. And Meena is a feminine gender. So, she is also a feminine gender. Now, common gender includes the words I, my, you, they, them, theirs and so on. For example, I am an engineer. Last is neuter. Neuter gender includes the words it, its, that, this and so on. For example, the recipe is too long. It has many varieties of food. So, in this sentence, recipe is a Neuter gender and in place of recipe, I have used the word it. So, it is also a neuter gender. So, next is case. If the pronoun is the subject of the Sentence, we say it is a subject pronoun. Subject pronouns go before the verb. The subject pronouns are I, you, he, she, it, we, they and so on. For example, she was present in the party yesterday. So, in this sentence, she is the subject pronoun. Next example. In the, uh, yeah, we practice the karate prayers for many hours. So, in this sentence, we is subject pronoun because we is used in place of Subject. If the pronoun is the object of the sentence, we say it is an object pronoun. Object pronouns go after the verb. The object pronouns are me, you, him, her, it, us, them and so on. For example, Radha gave her a pen. Okay. So. Yeah. Radha gave her a pen. So here. Radha. I am giving you extra example children. Gave her a pen. So here Radha is a. 
noun and her is a pronoun yeah so next is radha was playing hide and seek with them so here them is object pronoun next one is i'll give you more examples rahul wrote a letter to me so here rahul and me so in this sentence me is the object pronoun when we use pronoun to show that something belongs to someone we use the possessive form possessive pronouns are used to show ownership or possession the possessive pronoun are his hers ours yours mine theirs and so on so the example is the car belongs to raju the car is his so whose car it is the car belongs to raju and so he says used for raju so his the word his is possessive pronoun next one ravi and hemant bought a bat the bat is there so there's is a possessive pronoun so children hope you have understood this chapter so go through the all the rules study all the definitions and examples okay the lesson is very easy children so take care thank you bye bye